Right, morning. Welcome back to the vlog. It is our first full day, so I guess day two of the holiday. Someone's got up. Hello. Had a bit of a lie-in this morning, both of us were... Ten um, hours sleep, I had. Yeah, you had ten hours sleep. We needed it, because we were absolutely shattered. We had a lovely meal last night in a place called Brasaki, which is just out the door of Danny's, just down the road opposite. Really, really nice. I had chicken a la creme. You just had a little portion of spag bowl, didn't you? What did you have, Pam? Chicken souvlaki. Chicken souvlaki, nonetheless. Very Greek. When in Rome and all that. So, I don't know what we're going to do today. You saw there, that was the pool outside our room. That's the quiet pool. But it's very busy. I mean, it is 10 o'clock. 10 past 10 now, so it's to be expected. And You've been for a walk, haven't you? To the other pool. and yeah. It's very busy around very there busy. as well. So, I don't know what we're going to do. Might just go for a walk first. Have some breakfast and go for a walk. Um and I'll just film what we see on the way. So come along. So here we are at Danny's. Just uh, Oh, look at that lizard. I hope that camera's picking that up. There we go. Yeah. Most important job of the day, putting the pegs on the beds. It was windy yesterday. What are you ordered for breakfast, Ken? Pancakes. What, with what? Banoffee? Yeah. Banoffee pancake. You got the full Monty pan? Yeah. Just for Steve Furness, who will no doubt be watching this. Steve, I'm risking it. I'm having a coffee in Greece. Ken's, what is that? Look at the size of that. So he's got his banoffee. Pam, how's the uh, full Monty looking? Massive. 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 How was the full Monty? It was huge. Are you satisfied? I couldn't eat it at all. I think four rashes of bacon is a little bit excessive. Definitely. <laughs> How are your banoffee pancakes? Lovely. You like them? A bit Massive. too much, weren't they? Yeah. How much were they? About seven euros. Not bad for that one. No, not bad. It was good, wasn't it? Good afternoon now so we've had a lovely breakfast there this morning uh, Danny's seven euros for that so belting you get loads of bacon absolutely tons of bacon so we're just going for a little wander it's lunchtime we've not been really out yet because we've not after the long flight yesterday we just crashed last night just went locally I'll just turn you around and show you the taverna we're in last night so there we are that's called Vrisaki so that was amazing I had chicken a la creme uh, unbelievable, unbelievably good. Really, really nice place. Recommend that if you're in Ali Karnas. There's the uh, entrance to Danny's with the shop, the on site supermarket, folks. So that's where they keep the safety deposit box as well, is in that shop. So, really, really good. And then you've got down here, we've got Buster's Bar in the distance. Oh yeah, let's cross over, have a look at this round here. Lovely flowers, this is where we sat last night. Just about got the last table, um, so I would recommend booking at Vrisaki. But there you go, lovely, lovely taverna. We just sat there, I had, I had a bit of rose bush in my face. Oh, yeah. So let's keep walking, let's get onto the main street and we'll show you some more sights. So just down the road from Danny's as well there, you've got Mulberry Bar, um, you've also got Greek Acropolis to burn, I've heard that's meant to be very nice as well. And then down at the bottom you've got Busters. So let's have a look at the uh, what kind of things on the menu at the Greek Acropolis folks. Calf liver, belly pork, rack of ribs, lamb chops, mixed grill, sardines, swordfish, fish and chips with mushy peas too. Ooh. Do we have fish and chips and mushy peas? I doubt it. Nope. 
So everybody's advertising the football because it's Serbia England tonight. So every bar you're going will have that on. And there across the road is Busters. So as regular viewers to the channel will know, we normally go to Corfu. And uh, this is a lot busier than Corfu. Just generally on the road. There's just lots of cars about. So I guess this is the main strip. Uh, I can see in the distance you've got Zeus. Zeus bar just crossed over without getting killed. You've got Zeus bar, you've got Rua Mat. These are all meant to be very good taberners and, and bars. Very popular. And here we are, so this is Zeus bar. All open now. You've got Rua Mat there that looks uh, good. They've got Lam Shank a la creme. And a mixed souvlaki on the specials board today. So Caretta, La Caretta Hotel. And then Bosco restaurant and bar over there. Put in the comments, guys, if you've been to any of these places, let us know what they're like. Iguana. That's the menu at La Caretta. Decent pizzas there, don't they? Got Greco's over the road there. And then you've got another one here, Taverna Levant. That looks nice with the tablecloths. Interesting looking car coming down the road here, look. Look at that. So there's Catacombs, seen that on lots of vlogs. It's meant to be a, a nice bar in there. Up above, you've got the Pizza Giros place for your cheapo little quick meals and lots of shops big shop here doing all your pool things and your your toys if that's your thing bucket and spades that kind of stuff and then just down here on the left just about there we've got Bakiris now I've been recommended that place by my good friend Dom if you're watching Dom hello it's meant to be really really nice So another Giros place there, Giro Giro. With a bakery on the left. Really good. Lots, lots to do. So this place here is the newest shopping centre that opened last year. You've got that. Now they get run over again by the bus. And you've actually got a Chinese folks and an Indian. Would you believe if that's your thing? It's not for, not for me that while I'm on holiday, but I know some people crave that kind of thing when they're away so it's very busy I think everybody's going home for the siestas but yeah and Mackenzie's asking again where's the beach like I've been here a hundred times and I've absolutely no, no idea where the beach no idea where the beach is no I didn't you did jamming bar there dance the night away Nissos pool bar that's meant to be really really nice in there let's also tell there and they've got some hot tubs look on the balconies very posh here we are look at that look at those balconies up there quality so carissimo pizza here so Elia restaurant that smells lovely whatever's cooking in there oh dear don't end up like this guy so we're getting a little bit out in the sticks now, folks. Cozy Corner restaurant. Lovely flowers, look at that. Look at all the foliage and flora and fauna that there is. So that's where we're going, I think. Boca Beach House, and this is the way down to the beach. Down here, got Dilemma Bar. Harry Kane and Cristiano Ronaldo on the roof up there, look. Ali Karnas Beach Hotel, so if anybody's looking where that is, this is the location of it. A bit of a car park. We've come from Har Hotel, Danny's in that direction. So that looks a nice place. Ali Karnas Beach. I think that's the one that's got the slide in it, the water park. It's got like a little water park in there. I don't think it's for grown ups, it's more for little kids. But... Yeah. So this is Bucca, Bucca, on the beach. And 
And here we are, folks, at the beach. Oh, yeah, look at this. Oh, harbour. There's a harbour over there where I think you'll obviously see the turtles swimming on the morning. Yeah, just look at that. Glorious. Looks like there's some fires up there on the hill in the distance. And if you can pick, the camera can pick them out just up there. It's like something smoking, isn't there? Either that or somebody's having a bloody big barbecue. Here we are, folks. Alicarnas Beach. So yeah, it really is beautiful down here. Lovely beach. You can see there's people out quite away and it's only up to the waist. So it's lovely for the kids. It's lost my flip-flop. So it's lovely for the kids if you've uh, got young ones who aren't that confident with water. You know, I wouldn't say no, not, no sea is 100% safe, but probably as safe as you're going to get here. A bit like where we're going Corfu. So we've got the harbour off in the distance there, a little jetty just in front where you can go get on a speedboat if that's your thing. But look, I hope you can see them two people out there. Look, look how far out they are. Still only up to the waist. A lovely, lovely sea and beach down here in gorgeous Alicarnas. So here's where you get all your water sports folks. We've got little pedalos there with slides on. We've got your stand-up paddle boarding, if you like that. Um, yeah, it looks like there's lots to do down here on the beach. Just a free book. There's the mill bar look. So meant to be very good. We'll probably come to that um, Friday Greek night where you can pre book. It's lucky it looks good apparently. And here we have the harbour folks. So this is where apparently you get to see the turtles if they're about. Um, it's usually in the morning though I think from what I can gather. So there's something over here, a little viewpoint. Which I'll go have a look at now. little memoriam there to a guy obviously like this place yep rest in peace Craig nice little villa you can rent there really is a beautiful place and dear folks we have the harbour itself so like I say if you're lucky you'll see turtles down here but they tend to be around the boats in the morning I believe but the water is crystal look at this water look at that so we're at Ak I think it's Ax A-K-T-H beach bar uh, it looks cool here, really nice. It's like a pool that you can use. Got some lovely sunbeds over there. Really nice. So we're just having a pit stop out weekend. Mm -hmm. You're thirsty. You're going to have a slush, aren't you? that here folks hope you enjoyed that little walk along Alicarnas beach we are now at a place called Axe like I say it's a, it's a little pit stop for a cheeky beer because it's beer o'clock enjoy and I'll pick up with you later right where are we Do you know the name somewhere Bakiris <laughs> oh and here's the drinks look look at this Expert water pour in there, Pamela. So we're in Bakiris and we're looking forward to some chicken on the spit tonight. There's the men quick look at the menu. So what have you ordered? Pizza. Yeah, meat lovers pizza, haven't you? So it's got gyros on it, it's got a bit of everything, hasn't it? Pamela? I'm not saying, she'll take the mick out of me. It hasn't got pineapple on it, has it? Please tell me it's not got pineapple. 
who orders a pizza? Comments in the comments section down below. Pineapple on a pizza is absolutely illegal. No, it's awesome, Pamela, how was your uh, Hawaiian pizza? It's lovely. Really, really, really nice. nice. Looks good as that. Look at the cheese pull. It's a bit droopy. Very droopy. She loves a bit of droop. Yeah, it's a bit. 